What's up guys, it's Kenny here, and today I have my friend Mo Deep, a coaching client of ours, who we help bring from painting sidewalks all the way up to one of the largest debt consolidation companies inside of Canada. His story is super inspirational. He's gonna talk to you about, he's gonna show you around his office, he's gonna tell you a little bit about the results that he's gotten inside of our program, and he's also gonna share a recent purchase that he made as well. So, super inspirational story, you're gonna love it, and here we go, Mo Deep, coming up right now. Like it goes all the way there. Toronto's right down there, but it's like I I love it, man. I mean, I, it definitely costed us more than our other office, but like this is our boardroom. I'll show you where our sales employees work. So uh, this is like the doors, and that's the receptionist. She's gone for the day. Um, so this is the door here. This is where our sales employees work. So that's her computer set up over there. Um, the other girl set up here, but she brings her laptop in, right? But um, these desks are cool. You should definitely look into these. These are like 500 bucks. But you see the, you know, the stand-up desks, the one that can go like yeah, this? Yeah, they, they go up and down. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, this shit is fucking amazing. Like, <laughs> I, gotta, I have to get one for myself, but I got it for them so they can like, you know, stand up and work or whatever. But it's, it's definitely awesome. So they get their own view here. And I'll show you the other, other offices we have here. So this way we meet other clients. We, haven't, we still, still got to set this place up. Um, but this is our other view. So this is my printing room. Like this is where we used to print everything. Mm -hmm. um, and this is cool. Like this is, this is where um, the other two girls we're hiring now uh, this week are going to work. So they got their own views here and like you can see the roads and everything. So like, it's awesome, man. This shit's, this shit's, this shit's amazing. So, I mean, I, I, these guys can use it here. Cause I mean, you know, this is what I can show you guys. I mean, without, I mean, if I didn't learn from you, I keep, I keep coming back to it, but I always feel surreal to this day. Like, like it's crazy. Like I have an office and I'm, People were like the new guy we hired is like 36. I'm like 22, and it's like <laughs> it's crazy. It's so just, so uh, so just to explain to everybody like where you started, like how this all started for you. Uh well, I mean, um, I started with you when I was like 15, 16, and uh, we I, I used to just want to learn how to sell because I couldn't sell shit. So I knew that like I wasn't really that good in school or anything. So um, the only thing I could do really was is just sell. I know if I could sell something, I can make money. Um, I started off uh, learning. I think we did coaching together for a while. Uh, and I just think um, the thing I learned from you, the biggest thing is just follow what good people do. So, um, you know, I think the, the one thing we did early on was we called Craigslist and I called uh, people to just for website design and some shit like that, right? And mm -hmm. get myself on the phone. Um, so I used to just start selling SEO and, and Google and, all that sort of shit. And then um, that's what I did for a while and I was good at it, but it's so similar to you. I was good at selling the deal, but I had no one to fulfill the back end, right? Um, so then that, that sort of just like didn't, didn't go so well because I can, I can sell it all day long, but then I can't fulfill the back end. Right, because so there was started, a time when we yeah. were, I think when, when, I was, when I was working with you, I think there was a time where, where you took that Craigslist script which yeah. is made the only reason why I teach people at Craigslist, and I didn't even go into this with this group, but I can go into it yeah. tonight if you guys want to hear. But basically, the only reason why I teach that is to get people over the fear. You took that though, yeah. and you actually built something out of that, or tried to that script, yeah. right? You yeah. you tried yeah, to yeah. do websites or SEO, or whatever. I sold a couple of them. I sold like three of them. Uh, yeah. I, I still remember to this day. I sold like I sold like three of them, like a gardening website and um, something else. I forgot. Like, but it was just like three websites in total that I sold for five hundred bucks a pop. So I mean, you could do that all day long and and you know make fifteen hundred dollars a month and if that, if that satisfies you then you can do it but you know that's where i started but then then after, after that i didn't really know what industry i wanted to get in the biggest thing I'd, i learned from this i actually worked for a company for like um you know what four or five months uh learning the deck game to figure because that's what i'm in now i'm in, I'm in deck in the deck game I mean, in case anyone else doesn't know um so we help people with bankruptcies proposals and all that sort of stuff that consolidation so um i worked for someone else for like five months learned the whole game and then you know again it comes down to the same thing i knew i could sell it but i needed to know how to fill the back end that's why i didn't work for someone else in the first place because i wanted to learn how to fill the back end myself now we have staff that does it and all that which is which is great but you know i had to, I had to learn it for myself so i learned how to fill the back end and you know that's where that's where the whole debt journey started but you know, i keep uh, what i would tell anyone it's just like if you're learning from kenny anyone in this group you just have to learn exactly what he says and follow it like if you i think the biggest thing he told me is even if you just if, if the word is wrong the spelling is wrong just say it the way it fucking is i mean don't don't, don't change it 
right? Because it works that way. So I think a lot of people want to change things and make it their own, but, you know, why change something that works? So, um, you know, and you've been, been my mentor since, so. That's and I think, uh, I think too, a big lesson in, in, yeah. in, in your experience anyway, the, the, what, yeah. I, what I get out of it is that yeah. just because, and I don't, wanna, I don't wanna push anybody in a different direction here, but just because you're in this program or another program or whatever, what yeah. I teach you can be, a, Modif does depth. He doesn't yeah. do internet marketing. So, like, so I'm teaching you guys how to, we're using Facebook ads or web, web whatever we're using, we're using, but I'm teaching you guys how to sell stuff. Yeah. bottom line right so you took that and you applied it to something else exactly uh that, that that's sort of what i'm trying to get at actually the, is the beauty of what you do is that um like you can apply it to anything so whether you want to do plumbing or i think one time you told me to sell painting door to door you can sell painting like it is, doesn't matter what it is if you, if no, you, you know were doing the get, curves you were doing the numbers oh the curves yeah that's, that's what it goes the curves so i mean um, I, I mean, that was, a, wow, that's, that's old, right? That's memories yeah. right there. <laughs> yeah. And a lot of it too, I mean, like, yeah. you know, like I always say, a lot of it is just to get you over that initial step yeah. of going door to door, knocking on somebody's door and talking to them and, and painting on a curb is easy. So you could easily yeah. do that, you know. I could do it. I think that, I think, I think it's just the, the biggest thing for, um, for, for you is, you know, turn a qualified or turn a cold lead into a warm lead. If you can do that, you know, over a successful ratio and consistently, then you can figure out pretty much do anything else. I mean, if I wanted to do something else today, I could do it now because, you know, I can just, I can sell the deal. As long as I can learn how to fill the back end or all the business stuff behind it, you know, I can sell pretty much anything as long as it give, you give me two weeks to learn it basically now. Right. So, right, so, so in, in your, yeah. in your experience with this business and all the other businesses that you've been in, yeah. the yeah. the big deal is not closing the deal. The big deal is turning that person that don't yeah. know you into someone that is familiar with you. Yeah, and that's what we see for all our, our, so the two new sales girls that we just hired. Um, the since I told them the same thing. So uh, you know, as long as you can turn enough cold leads into warm leads, then you know, even if you can't close well, if you push enough people into the funnel and have enough warm leads, even if you're shit, you'll close them. And that's what we're seeing with these girls now. But you know, it's, our business is a little different because we don't work um, cold leads. We work warm people who actually submitted an inquiry. But you know, same thing. If we can pitch them successfully and you know if we pitch enough people of, out of those warm leads that we get in our business what i tell all my employees is just you know you will get deals and that's what they're seeing now it, it's not, if, if they stay late and they pitch seven eight people a day even if you're fucking terrible you'll get two of those people like and you're, you're running the basic, and, and you're running facebook ads an application or you're doing you're yeah that, that, that's sort of the hurdle that we had recently but we, we overcame it so you know we, we're basically exactly we just run, run facebook ads to a, a landing page uh, and the landing page gets a lead. It's a qualified lead because it's not just a name, email, phone number. It's like a name, email, phone number, a detailed description, what kind of debt they have. It's like a very you know, lengthy, long form lead. So when it comes to us, the person's willing to to speak to us, right? So. Um, and the average ticket of your sale is what? Like it's like fifteen hundred. Sixteen ninety five. Sixteen ninety five, in, including tax. So fifteen hundred plus tax in Canada. Right, fifteen hundred plus yeah. tax. To yeah. now, there, there, there's some there's some details behind this that we're not going to get into, but. To broke yeah. people, yeah, which is to really hard people. to do. To broke people, yeah. yeah. And what do you think your closing ratio is on that? Uh, out of well, I personally, uh, I'm sort of the, the one everyone looks up to in the office because uh, I personally, out of every ten leads, will close four to five. So my closing ratio is either forty or fifty percent, just depending on the batch. Every batch is different, uh, but you know, on average, it's about uh, two clients for every ten leads. That's what on a sixteen hundred dollar deal to broke people. Yeah. You guys are giving away free software to businesses, and you're complaining. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> that's why if I if I got into the fucking the review now for, game, listen, the, for, for the listen, software, I'd kill it. Right for the people that are here, that this is your first week. Ignore what I just said. <laughs> <laughs> you got to get used to me a little bit. But like, there's the people yeah. here that's been here for six months, and they're like, "Oh my god, this guy said I'm not interested." Or whatever. Like, Modib's yeah. selling sixteen hundred dollars packages. People that are in debt, like they're you coming to him for credit help. Like they don't have money, and no. he's closing half of them. The thing is, if you ask people, and no matter who they are, I mean, if I hold out a gun to your head and your daughter's head or whatever, and I said, "Give me sixteen ninety-five," I've used that on the phone actually, and you know, you'd give me sixteen ninety-five, and then they yes. say, "Yeah, of course I would, of course I would," and then it could, you know, these people, you can pretty much say whatever they want because I guess you know, sort of, they're in a vulnerable situation, so it's different a little bit because they need the help, but you know, it's the same sort of thing. But if they'll find the money, a lot of people are scumbags as well, where they don't want to pay you the money, they don't want to, you know, take care of the debt, so you have to convince them a little bit, but. 
at the end of the day, right. it's, it's still a sale. Right? Well, it's there's a reason why they're in debt. Yeah. They don't want to pay yeah. you. I mean, it's... Obviously. But at least they're coming I, I, out and trying to take care of it. So let me ask you this then. Out of, yeah. out of all the people out there that you could have learned from, why did you choose me? Uh, well, I mean, you, you seemed the most real, and I think that's what everyone has to understand because a lot of these people – because back then, I, I'll be honest with you, I, I was – in the in the shiny object syndrome sort of phase where you know you buy a product and then it, you just try to learn it and then you don't really learn it and you buy the next product that's the phase I was in but you know and everyone shows the Lamborghinis the jets and all this sort of stuff and it's, at the end of the day I think everyone really knows that that shit's not real like you know it's rented and all that like, you know that so with you you don't do any of that stuff you just show real numbers and you don't have Ferraris, Jets, and all that stuff that you show. You just show, listen, I'm a real business guy. I well, I don't show because I don't have it. You know. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I got well, a Jeep Wrangler and an F-150. I, I, think, I think you'd fucking you'd be very disappointed in this one decision, but I have to do it. I, I, I was looking the other day, so I'm, I'm getting um, – I'm not getting it just yet, but I, as long as the financing is approved, I think uh, I've decided on a Ferrari 458 Italia Spider. I so that's what I've decided. <laughs> I so I just I, I, I've um, I, I, I get my my mom and everyone's telling me you know stupid decision don't do it but I, fuck man I, that's that's the only thing I want in life I just want an amazing exotic car and I can afford it so you know, and you've been I'm doing and, and listen you've been doing this stuff this business stuff since you were like like you said in the beginning I, I've been working you since you were in high school yeah, yeah. so Young. Yeah. now is the time five seven <laughs> years later treat yourself so let me ask you one, one last mm -hmm. motive, one last question. If there's somebody yeah. that's on the fence about working with me or somebody that has questions, what, what would you tell them? Uh, I would I mean, the only thing I would tell you is I mean, if you're going to take the leap, you're going to take the leap anyway. I mean, you know, most people end up buying a product, whether it's today or 12 months from now, you're going to buy a product, but I would take the leap of faith with Kenny because, you know, it's, just look for yourself. And the guy doesn't show off any Ferraris or Lamborghinis or anything like that. So it, it, it's, it's a, he's a real person, a real business guy. You know, you don't see Warren Buffett driving around those kind of cars. All these like sales gurus drive the same thing. So it's like, you know, if you're on the fence about something, just look at where the real results come from. Real results come from selling a product. If you want to learn how to sell a product, can you invest? I mean, it's as simple as that. I mean, if you don't sell, there's no revenue. There's no revenue. You don't make any money. So that's the first thing you got to learn. So if, if you get nothing else from Kenny, just learn how to sell. I mean, when, again, like I said, I learned from him starting internet marketing um, and learning how to sell SEO, but now I sell debt consolidation. So it's, you know, doesn't matter what it is, it's learning how to sell. And I think Kenny's the best thing to, Kenny can teach you that basically. And you went from high school to a Ferrari, never whatever number school. you said, yeah. I don't know what that is because I don't pay attention to that stuff. But you <laughs> buying a $300,000 car, whatever it is. Yeah. That's amazing. All right, man. I mean, well, that's, that's awesome. That's pretty much it, man. Yeah, I just wanted to show you the office. I mean, like, without you, man, like I always say, it could, it could have never happened. So I think about you all the time, just like, fuck, like, this is like crazy for me. It's still surreal, but, you know, it's, uh, you know, hopefully it goes best for multiple years to come. So I hope you guys loved that interview with Mo Deep. Again, it's a super inspirational story. I just wanted to pop on here one more time and let you know that I'm going to tell you this. He'll tell you this. He is not unique. He is not special. Yes, I love him to death. He's a great coaching client of mine. I've been working with him for a long time. And I'll tell you right now, the reason why he's such a good coaching client is because he does what I teach him to do. So listen, if you're someone who wants more income out of life, if you want to have a story like Mo Deeps and like so many other people that we've worked with, book a call with our team by clicking the link below and we'll see if we can help you. We'll talk to you for about a half hour, 45 minutes, find out what your goals are, find out what your vision is find out what problems you're having and if we can help you we'll talk about how we can do that so book a call below it's a free 45 minute session with either myself or one of my staff members i look forward to talking to you and hopefully you can be one of these interviews in the future click below book a call and we'll talk soon take care